from the high-stakes drama of the NBA to the tales of high school and college basketball teams, the shows on this list offer a slam dunk of entertainment for basketball fans. So get ready to hit the court as we dribble our way through the best TV shows about basketball. A quick disclaimer before we start, keep in mind that in this countdown we're featuring only scripted shows and that these series are listed in no particular order. With that out of the way, this is TV Show Pilot, and here are our top 10 TV shows about basketball. Winning Time, The Rise of the Lakers Dynasty. Fuck you too. Fuck no. It doesn't matter where they got it. It does fucking matter. No, it doesn't matter because what matters is this. It's not the truth. All right? We're picking Johnson. <sighs> That's a big mistake. Well, all right. It's a mistake. But we're doing it, all right? Look, Moncrief is a fine player. Great he player. Moncrief is a great player. And you know what, Jerry? Fuck this. He's also a better scorer about five fucking points a game. We'll start off this list with a series that showcases how the Los Angeles Lakers became the success that they are now. Set in the 1980s, Winning Time follows both the professional and personal lives of the 1980s Los Angeles Lakers, a team that even now is regarded as one of the best and most revered basketball teams of all time. Featuring notable NBA stars like Magic Johnson and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, the show starts with Jerry Buss buying the team and drafting college phenom Magic Johnson. Swagger. Coach, if we win the DMV tournament, are we going to Florida for nationals? Uh, we'll be eligible. Florida tournament costs money. You know what? If we win a DMV, I'll find some sponsors. I'll, I'll figure it out. We going. For real? Yeah. <laughs> That's what's up. Yeah. Speaking of notable NBA stars, Apple TV Plus's Swagger is another series that chronicles the rise of a basketball star. Inspired by the life of NBA player Kevin Durant, Swagger follows Jace Carson, a 14-year-old basketball prodigy who joins the Swagger DMV team coached by former rising basketball star Ike Edwards. And during the show, we see the ins and outs of youth basketball, not only when it comes to the players themselves, but also the ambitions of their parents and coaches. Survivor's Remorse So, Ma, I know you watching from home. I just got one thing to say. Thank you for not aborting me. <laughs> that would have sucked. <laughs> I mean, not just for me, for y'all. <laughs> I love you, Ma. Next up, we have a sitcom with a touch of family drama. Stars series Survivor's Remorse follows Cam Calloway, a professional basketball player who moves to Atlanta after signing a multi-million dollar pro ball contract. While you might think that fame and wealth will provide Cam with a great new life, he quickly finds out that bringing his entire family with him results in the same set of problems, just at a whole new, upgraded level. Big Shot. Oh, please tell me you did not just say that. I couldn't possibly have. Okay, team. Eyes open, legs down. Now I want you all to raise your right hand as high as you can. Right hand, raise it. Now, knees bent, good. Now I'd like you all to wave goodbye to Louise Grzynski. She's suspended from the team. What? From men's basketball, we switch to the women's side of things with these next two series. First up, we have Disney Plus's Big Shot, a series starring John Stamos. The show follows Marvin Korn, a hot-headed college basketball coach who is forced into coaching a girls' high school team after he gets fired for throwing a chair at a referee. With the help of his assistant coach, Korn must navigate the challenges of coaching teenage girls at an elite all-girls private school while working to get his personal life in order. Long, slow exhale. I want y'all to feel the joy of these last few seconds, no matter the outcome. Remember what it took to get here. Remember where we came from. Each of you made this happen, and I am so proud of all of you. This is our moment. Believe on three. One, two, three, believe!
Another fairly new show about women's basketball is Long Slow Exhale. This series centers on J.C. Abernathy, the head coach of a competitive women's college basketball team. After leading her team to win the NCAA Women's Basketball Championship, Abernathy's career is threatened when a potentially career-shattering scandal comes to light. So now Abernathy has to untangle the truth about what happened and make hard decisions that will affect not only her life, but also the lives of the female athletes who rely on her. The Crossover Our life, there was only one word in our dictionary, win. I'm dribbling at the top of the key. I'm moving and grooving. I'm popping and rocking. Why you bumping? Why you locking? Man, take this stuff in. Bro, let's play ball, man. What you got? The newest series on this countdown is Disney Plus's The Crossover. Based on a Kwame Alexander novel of the same name, The Crossover follows twin brothers Josh and J.B. Bell, who are wildly regarded as basketball phenomena. The coming-of-age drama shows J.B. and Josh navigating life on and off the basketball court as they dedicate their lives to the sport. On top of school, training, and games, the two have to deal with changing family dynamics when their former pro ball player father learns to adjust to life after basketball, while their mother finally gets to pursue her own dreams. Sunshine. I gotta go. Is everything okay, Jay? Yeah. Hey, brother. We're the Sunshine Kings. Yeah, 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 <laughs> boy. we champions. From the U.S., we're moving to Australia with this four-part miniseries. Sunshine focuses on Jacob Garang, a young South Sudanese Australian basketball player who dreams of one day playing in the NBA. But Jacob's future is in jeopardy when he becomes entangled in a criminal investigation after going for a joyride in a stolen car with his friends. Hang time. Uh, excuse me, but th this is a close practice. I just opened it. Jamie. Will you tell this girl that this is a boys' varsity basketball? Me? Listen, you know, you're really not supposed to... Oh, nice shot. How'd you get your hand to fall through like that? What do you think you're doing? Just tell your friend here that I'm trying out for the team. We're going back now to the mid-90s with NBC's Hang Time. This coming-of-age sitcom centers on Julie Connor, who moves to Indiana from Chicago with her family. After displaying amazing basketball skills, the coach of the Deering Tornadoes boys varsity basketball team decides to make Julie the first female player for their team. But the decision is met with a lot of resistance from the team's players. So during the series, we see the team adjusting to having a girl on their team, all while dealing with problems all high schoolers go through. The White Shadow. It's like we got ourselves a new coach. <laughs> That's right. All right, you guys, I want you to divide uh, say, yourselves man. in the... Keep the volume down. What's your name? <laughs> uh, Hayward. Mine's Reeves. Mm. You remember mine, because I'm going to remember yours. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you remember mine, because I'm going to remember yours. <laughs> if we are counting down the best basketball TV shows, then we also couldn't forget to mention CBS's The White Shadow. Premiering in the late 1970s, the White Shadow was a groundbreaking show for its time, since it explored many topics that were oftentimes left out of shows during that time period. The White Shadow follows Ken Reeves, a recently retired NBA player who becomes the basketball coach at a mostly black and Hispanic high school in South Central Los Angeles. And although at first the Carver High School basketball team has a hard time relating to their white coach, Soon enough, Reeves begins to make a positive impact on them, both on and off the court. Hoops. Come on, man. Are we really doing this again? These guys are a foot fucking taller than us, Jeremy. You gotta call it even on both sides, you prick. And we'll end this video with the only animated series on this list. Netflix's Hoops is an adult animated sitcom that follows Ben Hopkins, a bad-tempered, foul-mouthed high school basketball coach with dreams of making it to the big leagues. His only chance of doing that lies in his ability to turn the current Lenwood high school basketball team from losers into winners. But more often than not, his efforts end in disaster. Do you agree with our picks for the top 10 TV shows about basketball? Let us know in the comments. 
Check out tvshowpilot.com for the full list of the best basketball series. And don't forget to subscribe to the TV Show Pilot YouTube channel for more videos like this.